Hello, hello everyone. It's Stray Faye here with another episode of Shepherd's Crossing. All right, we farmed a lot of meat. A lot of meat. <laughs> so much meat. Uh, and our dogs are probably gonna gobble it up in just like a few days. Uh, so yeah, we're still on the tail of grapes, going a little slowly, but we did get a lot of like sight animals. We got like a baby, baby goat. We got pigs, which I didn't expect to get so early since our, our we got lucky, our boar found a bunch of truffles. So yeah, we are gonna watch our dogs gobble, gobble up that meat <laughs> and hope. I'm just looking at the Sheba dog. I'm gonna see if it, ooh. Okay, I got a little chocolate brown boar. That's cute. Uh, let's see, is there anything different? You're a female, which means you can breed again. Nothing else there. But yeah, the, the boars... The different colored boars are actually like really, really tanky. <laughs> uh, and they can actually collect small games. So they are kind of an alternative... Alternative, uh... Creature that you can use for, uh... For hunts other than just dogs. Uh, oh, my black marmot got old. <laughs> All right, where's my other marmot? Oh wait, before before he became an elderly old marmot, he, he got that one pregnant one more time. So I guess that's their last progeny. I'll, if that one doesn't become like a different colored one, I'll probably just get rid of them. Um, All right, well, rest in pieces, sir. You, you will you will be missed. We will remember you. Uh, I guess I'll just put you myself. <laughs> the my little duck friend is is clipping, clipping them for me, but eh, too much too much fluff. We got some more carrots, which I do want to stockpile these. Uh, I think once I get rid of my rabbits. My standard rabbits, my boring old standard rabbits. I will exchange these carrots for Angora rabbits. I think to get like more bang out of my buck, I I did when I first got Angora rabbits because I knew about the different colored hair that I could register in my diary. I just like bred all the colors, <laughs> and then I'm like I just positioned all the rabbits around one carrot. I'm just like you. Eat that, and you all you all grow hair at the same time. Just trying to efficiently use one carrot for multiple for, for multiple uh, bunnies. These are the last of the season. Uh oh, I just started recording, and my boyfriend's like, "I just got out. I'm sorry." <laughs> Uh, he's gonna be very disappointed when he realizes I'm playing Shepherd's Crossing. I don't know. I don't know. You guys disappointed that I'm playing Shepherd's Crossing. It's it's a good game. Really grindy. But I'm pretty sure someone out there will appreciate me trying <laughs> trying to grind out as much of it as I can. Not, not many people covering this game. I'm actually kind of surprised. I, I bet it because it got, it got drowned out with all the other farming sims. Because this came out in September when we had that farming sim boom. Uh, male... I'm out of seeds. Amazing. You are a male. Good thing I didn't get distracted. <laughs> At one time I did not get distracted enough to not reload. I do want- I do want that Sheba to be a female. Okay. Good outcome. I have so many doxes. <laughs> Ooh, I got another truffle. <laughs> Yoink. Uh, I guess I could just save this in the future in case I ever decide to get rid of my pigs and my boars. Um, at least I'll have the truffle and be like, hey, I can just get pigs back at any time. It's just reassurance. 
you're still growing. You're still pregnant. Can you lay eggs, please, so I can so I can give you back your babies? Now you're just eating all the daikons. Now Crony's like, oh, I could move these. Like, please don't. I'm trying to have you guys eat these. No, you guys aren't. You guys are just. You guys are just bumming it out here. Very soon, I'm gonna just probably kill them all. Probably gonna kill them all off soon. <laughs> They're all gonna become me. Got you chow down on all of that. Ooh, actually, ooh, perfect. I got the last basset. Which means I gotta like slowly call off all my bassets. <laughs> Uh, you need to reunite with the male, so you can make babies. I need to do something with this basset problem. What can I trade the bassets for? I got- Oh my god, <laughs> why am I getting so many truffles? <laughs> the game's never blessed me this much. What did, what did I do? What's wrong with this? What's so wrong with this game? Is it like a, a personalized walkthrough? Where <laughs> every file is different! I've never gotten so many berry colors! Like the, with the orange and the yellow berries, and I've like never gotten this many truffles before. Uh, I don't know if I want- do I want Corgi? Corgi or Retriever? I already forgot what each one can give me. I do have like a market guide, but it also is out of date because it's like the PS2 version, so some of it's not accurate to like the the remake of the game. Chiba Sheepdog. Either or. Okay, that's the answer. Sheepdog. I, yeah, both, both of them will eventually net me a sheepdog, so... I guess. Fever. Fevers are a little bit more valuable than corgis <laughs> in terms of utility. Oh, okay. Uh, our baby goat is no longer a baby. We have a, we have a young goat, so now every day we can milk that goat <laughs> for ourselves and not starve the baby. Spoiled milk can last many months when made into cheese. It's very interesting, actually. Milk collected the same day can be curdled in exactly the same way, but it won't taste the same. It's not just because of the difference in soil or animals. The flavor also varies widely. Depending on who makes it, the taste changes every single time, so I can never get enough of cheese making. Alright, if you put this next to a shelf of cheese, <laughs> a fairy will turn it into cheese for us. The cheese fairy, alright. That's, 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 I accept that explanation, so yeah, put it next to the shelf of cheese, same, same as the ham. Um, if it's working, then this will become a partial cheese, and then we just have, to, just have to wait for the cheese to ripen. Uh, okay. How many, how many retrievers do I have? Uh, yeah, the, the number is yes. That's how many retrievers I have. Uh, all right, let's make sure you can eat food. Save 
love you. I'd be kind of interesting with the carrots and other fruit. Um, I think when we get the Claire statue, she can actually turn that into jam. Then you can like trade it for like more carrots. It's pretty much like a multiplier. Mm, I wonder if I. Like, I kind of want to wait to see you get geriatric. I think I think you're my oldest bunny. I want to see a geriatric bunny. We're all going to be turned into meat. Phasing out the bunnies. Rabbit, rabbit meat. You are actually not male or female. You are you are young. Live another day. Oops. Sorry, you're not meat. You're not not yet. <laughs> you're not meat yet. Hang out there for a sec. I'm gonna trade you. Some retrievers, so then I can trade those for sheep dogs. Okay, this feels like a mistake, but we will do it. Forgot about this blasted cabbage. Hang out there for a second, little goslings. They're like, I'm hungry. Your bunnies. I haven't, I haven't given you a reason to make me here in a while. Are they trying? They're trying to make their way back to the the mother goose. Like an old, like an old tail. The mother, the mother goose. I haven't read those old like mother goose tales in so long. I remember when I was a young child and those were a thing in kindergarten. <laughs> Alright, another day. Got a pregnant duck. Now right, you're pregnant! Okay. Well, that's all that really matters. That's all that's, all that's really changed. Oh, there's, there's so many female bassets. Why aren't- oh, I got a male. I got a male and male goose. Both of you became male. Wait. Why do I have two male goose? <laughs> Why do I have two male geese? Why aren't you grown up? That You're the- you're the pair. You're the bonded pair. The twin. You're not pregnant. You can eat that. I officially don't want to deal with... No, you can pick up that egg to Mimi. I officially just don't want to deal with <laughs> these ducks anymore. So I think, I think we're good. I'm phasing out some animals. You're not meat. I mean, I guess in some cultures they might turn you into meat. The horrible dog meat market. Ugh. Meat. Chicken meat. I think my box is full. <laughs> yeah, the chicken the rooster is like, hey, I can't fit in your inventory. But yeah, the freaking dog meat industry makes me so sad. 
It's not even really an industry, because if it was, I feel like it would be regulated, but... I mean, one can argue that we eat other sources of meat, but... I feel like, I feel like there's uh, industry standards that don't involve involve torture. And plus dogs are like companion animals. They want to give us their love. Alright, more milk. And also this is partial cheese. Uh, don't move it. Don't touch it. <laughs> If, it, if it's turned into partial cheese, that means, that means it's working. Uh, let me see if I... I'm not as hard to position, position it. Uh, you can also trade the milk for other things. Let me actually see what I can trade it for. I think like pasture seeds is one, one item. I can also get duck feathers. <laughs> wow, I really, the ducks are really obsolete. Uh, I can get foie gras and ferret pelt. So yeah, I guess uh, once you get goats... The ducks, the geese, and the ferrets become obsolete. The game's way of saying, like, hey, you accomplished... You accomplished something. Uh, so yeah. Probably get rid of the geese, too. Let me show off how we make foie gras. We'll need some buckwheat seeds. Same as ducks, if you them either buckwheat or wheat. Uh, but instead of clipping them, you take them to market and <laughs> you permanently lose the goose. But that's how it- that's how life works. Eventually you will notice that this is behind you. Uh, I don't think this works on the- on the female geese. Although in real life it probably would. Right. Goose. You are... Turning into meat, sorry. <laughs> the age of the geese is over. Or the age of the ducks, rather. The geese is, the geese are next. The geese are next on the chopping block. Alright, no more dealing with them. That way I don't have to micromanage them and then we can just keep progressing the days faster because <laughs> this is this is holding us back. Okay. I think we're ready to proceed today. Uh, the one thing I want to look out for is mainly the Sheba. I want to I want the next color tier. Ooh, let me grab that. I want the next color tier of Shiba. Because they are powerful hunters! Until we get the German Shepherd. Which is, might take us a while, I don't know. <laughs> Sometimes the game is really nice to me and lets me progress really fast by giving me the item I need. Oh, there we go. Big male goose. This goose is pretty big. You can turn it into a large serving of foie gras at the market. Alright, and I will do that. I will do that right now. Yep, this one's nice and plump. Take it to the market and see what you can get. Alright. <laughs> Feels bad, man. I just fatten you, fatten up your liver. Make some foie gras. I can't say I've ever tried foie gras. Apparently it's a delicacy. It sounds very hard to make. can trade a carrot for a duck for some reason. Why? There we go. And we can trade foie gras for... For boars, retrievers, corgis. Same as... Same stuff as uh, the feathers, except you need just like one less of it. You can trade this for a boar. Of course a retriever would be useful when hunting. The boar helps you finish the chapter. <laughs> the tail of boar chapter. Alright, I guess I'll just save this meat. It is meat. If you leave it out um, on the map, it'll eventually... It'll eventually become, a uh, Meat scraps. And then your dogs can eat it after that. Oh, 
Why would you want it? Why would you want it to turn into meat scraps? Hey, Eggy. I guess I'll keep you. I could turn you into a fence. Yeah, uh, Tememi is holding an egg, and he's gonna bring it to the egg shed and leave it there. That's just how it works. Uh, okay, you are... You turned into a male. Let me get rid of you. Dachshunds! What can I turn dachshunds into? I can turn you into another retriever! I'll do that until I get enough sheepdogs. There we go. This goose will probably become another... Another, uh... Ooh, you are a female. <laughs> Please take care of the babies. I'm not sure if I... I'm like, I'm not sure if I want to turn it into foie gras. I'm gonna let it live for now, if I have doubts. I feel like with the heavy culling of the ducks... I feel pretty... pretty... pretty liberated <laughs> after getting rid of them. Chickens, you're next. You're next on the chopping block. Okay, saved! Progress another day! Oh, you were a male. That's fine. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, keep an eye on the Shiba, specifically. Uh, I just saw another Corgi pop up. <laughs> Ooh, I, I got a crap ton of male retrievers. All right, get rid of some of you. Okay, that's as. Just need two. Young sheep dog. Get two of these. All right, now I can't really do anything else with the retrievers other than just breed them for more colors. You can use this dog to hurt sheep. If you're interested, Clara's f can't say that word. Focaccia and Lucky can teach its skills. One of the hunting trophies is a sheep dog statue, so go and win it. There is a sheep chasing competition. If you make it your partner, you can collect sheep. <laughs> Another dog that's like very specific in its use. Like, like it's so, so super specific. Mm. I'm gonna probably make another baby. I don't really want that, but if I am if I am dumb and I don't ensure this is a female, I might just have to keep a cream colored one for a little longer. I'm like yeah, there's an egg in the egg shed. You can harvest it with a jar. Uh, let's now that we have sheep dog, let's make sure we have the sheep dog statue. Then we bought Shepherd? Yeah, we bought Shepherd last time. Uh, we also need Collect Sheep, so I'll just grab that. That's like the last of the dog statues that's offerable here. For points, you learn Collect Sheep. That skill from Lucky. And you go. You go in the pile. Well, let's clean this up. Too much junk. Now the this is getting a little bit too full of stuff that I don't really need. Okay. Still keeping a lookout for that Shiba to give birth. <laughs> Alright, save one more time. We're almost at no grass. There's no no more crops. I'm not sure if my carrots will die. Grow up! I've seen some carrots survive in the winter. Like they, just, they have like enough, barely enough health to like 
for chore. The last days of the season. Wild boars came to wreck my farm. They're like, heck that! There's like a million dogs here, you crazy? Okay, I'm just gonna proceed another day. Come here. Come here! <laughs> They're all spreading around. I don't know where- there you are. Like, I don't know where you went. Nope. Bobcats. Bye. Alright, that one didn't become. That one did not become a different color, so we're gonna reload. At least I know it's gonna- it's gonna pop out of that mother on grass one. Load. Mm, wild boars came from the opposite side. Okay, I totally forgot I should probably be milking my goat. Hi. Eggs can be fed to your partners too. Uh oh. Non-fertilized goose egg. <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't get one of those yet. What do you mean they can be fed to my partner? Wait. Oh, I could trade these for more blocks and buckwheat seeds. Wheat seed. I thought I could get one of them. I thought you could trade this for bricks, but maybe I'm thinking of a different... a different item. Accidentally pick up cheese. <laughs> I might need some more mangers. Alright. Time to buy more things from the kennel. Oh, so profitable. So profitable to. <laughs> To hunt. 2,000 points. I almost actually have enough. This is Sophia's statue. I'm trying not to buy like these other things which do like protect you somewhat from bad weather. Like as soon as I get 2,500 points I'm gonna get the Sophia statue because that's just that's just a big surmountable mountain that I need to surmount. Over here. What are you? You are nursing. Ooh, piggies. of you. Meal. Don't I have three? <laughs> Where'd the other one go? Hello? Where'd you go? Did you get eaten by my dogs? That's not a thing, but... There you are, you're a male. Alright, well as long as you turn into a female. I could I could actually turn one of you into pork. And get some canola seeds. Which I do believe is a winter crop. Am I gonna mm, do I need more Yeah, I might need more seeds for the geese. Got a crap ton of carrots now. I, I am ready for the Angoras. I never wanted to race. I like I knew of Angoras when I was like a little bit younger. It's like I I when I was a little bit younger, more naive and didn't realize how expensive getting property is. I didn't want to get like a little hobby farm. Like raise goats and like angora rabbits. But oh, man, just getting anything here is expensive. All right, now for realsies. Pop out that baby. Oh, God, I got a snail. Uh, look. 
<laughs> Singing the acorn graphics. It's a snail, cute, isn't he? You can stuff snails with garlic and shallot butter, cook them up, and voila, escargo. Air they taste even better if you use some wine. That didn't pop up before. <laughs> My grapes are like <laughs> almost at the harvest stage, but I don't think they are, they're harvestable at this stage. Where? All right, no oh god. You popped out a baby, but where did it go? Oh, there it is! It's nursing on the other one. It's white. Oh, okay. Lucky. I accidentally picked you up. Sorry. Okay, so we're at the next color tier of Sheba. What I'm looking at next. I want to make sure you're a female. So that's the next thing I'm going to scum for. Mm, I'm gonna get rid of you. Yeah, I think I need to get I need to get rid of you. I have enough. I have enough facets. I'm surprised that chocolate rabbit gave birth to a white one. It skipped over the last color stage, the black stage. It's like, nope. I'm gonna go to default. The white. The white one. Uh, where the heck did that snail go? Oh, I didn't pick it up. Mm, it will wander... Somewhere. Oh, I took my eyes off it. Oh, there it is. It went to the dead grass over here. There you are! They live by grape trees. Yeah, they spawn... They spawn from the grapevines. And then they they tend to wander towards crops. But since my crops are, like, all over there... They're, like, trying to wander over to, like, the next best thing, which is the grass. Alright, so I can trade snails for stuff. Uh, you're becoming a male. I'm gonna get an extra sheepdog. And then no matter what you guys turn into, I will automatically get a breeding pair. I kind of want to register this Basset. <laughs> Just because it's cream colored. Uh, I can get grape seeds. I have two. I can get three grape seeds. Now the problem arises. I don't think I can store this. Like, technically a critter. So it is more efficient to get two and then trade it for a grape seed. But if it's just dangling in my bag, then yeah, I don't really want to hold on to it for very long. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll register this Basset. But probably won't keep it for very long because it's gonna get replaced by a better one. It does look cute though. It's not it's not patchy colored, so <laughs> like name it cream or something. Nice cream colored. And it does have a lot better stats than the bass that we have. It has four attack, 23 HP. But big ol' butt. There's a better one on the way. Okay. It's like, not to myself. I'm actually, where'd the basset go? There it is, up there, blending in with the, with that. All right, let's save, do another, do another day. About to tear my hair out. So many things we gotta keep track of. Want. You are a male. It looks like Claire wants to invite you hunting. Farmer sheep got out. You can get a reward if you manage to catch him. I don't have. Why'd you give me this one? I don't have sheep dogs registered. <laughs> In any case, I gotta reload anyway, cause that the bass didn't become a female. The last one. It's the last color tier, so. Maybe it'll give me a different hunt. Oh, you are still a male! Load successful. 
That, was, that, that, that took a little longer. <laughs> a little bit worried. Okay, you're eating. It's a fence. Still counts! Okay, female. Happy. You are on the wrong side of the fence. Go this way. Right, what's the next thing I need to worry about? You worry about that. Oh, it's gonna take a few days before that happens. What can I trade the Shibas for? Oh, we got two males. Wait, where are you going? Sir. It wants to carry sheep's hair. Don't have any of that. Ooh, I got another snail. Dog's like, what the heck is that? Come here. No. Okay, thank, thank you. Hmm, I think. I'll just trade you for a male. I still need you for breeding. I can trade you for a whippet. Or a pointer. I'll turn you into a male. But I won't trade you yet. I won't trade you away yet. I need you to make more babies. With the... With my colored ones. Uh, everything looks okay here. I need to clip you. Add you to the hair pile. Goose. Goose egg, you are... Uh... The wrong one. Oops, you are. Ugh. Gotta reposition this a little closer. <laughs> I think I just messed that up. <laughs> I think like you can fit up to like six cheeses next to this shelf. But it looks like I won't be able to get that one. Close enough. Cause my fence is in the way. Okay, I'll get some more grape seeds and I'll plant these. These will sprout probably in dandelion. Where do I want to put you? You be out of the way over here. You're just. These are just kind of extra, so I don't mind where they go. I can always destroy them later. I got- I can't believe I got three pigs! Three male pigs. Alright, well... That's fine. I can exchange it for a female. I also have a ton of truffles, so I can actually get myself another young pig. So I can change that into pork. Yeah, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait for my uh, other pig to get pregnant and I'll, and I'll slaughter the male. Okay, red... No, I'll wait for... I'll wait to see what this gender is. We're registering it. Right, goose egg, I don't know what to do with you, so I'll just save you. I guess I'll just slaughter this chicken. This <laughs> is like I, hmm. I'm almost, I've almost called all my chickens. Hmm. Yeah, I'll put you over here so I can see your brethren and surround you with a with a box of meat. Okay, save! Proceed another day. Good. Mm. Okay, everything looks- everything looks fine. You are probably gonna breed in a moment. Oh, I got more chase out skill points. Alright, cool. Little Rooney. Still eating.
I got more attack. All right, happy with that. I should probably save. Okay, you're a female. Perfect, perfect! That means I can... What can I trade sheepdogs for? What's the exchange rate on you? Whip it. Pointer. Okay. Well, I just need one. Uh, I just need one of... Where, where'd the female go? There you are. What are you doing? Female wants to carry sheep hair as well. Dachshund. Need to start getting rid of some dachshunds. I'm not sure if I can trade this for anything. What was dachshund again? Retriever and corgi. I think I'll just get. I think I'll just get rid of it by registering it and just retiring it. Running low on space. I <laughs> see, so yeah, I can just register female dachshund. Go to my partner list. I only have like two more spots. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get rid of someone. Cream might have to leave. Uh, register. What do I want to name you? What was the. What was the. The sheep dog and babe. It's a different dog. This this looks like this looks like a diff different breed than the border collie. But uh, I know the female was fly. Was it Rex and Fly? Is that the two border collies? I'll I'll name you Fly. I don't think the game really recognizes you <laughs> as like a female after I register you. Fly. And as a partner. Okay, let's teach you some. Skills. Did I get any more? I did not get more collect small. It's like the last thing I need to teach Shale is just how to collect small critters. Alright, so fly. Your one job is to collect sheep. So how many skill points do you have? Sheep dogs. Um, they do have varying attack points. Oh, I actually never wrote down how many <laughs> how many what the skill cap is on a sheep dog. Well, it does come with four things of collect sheep. We'll probably want a little bit more. But to to do the sheep hunt, you need to like first drive them off. Not like the the cattle the cattle drive skill. Uh, after driving them off, you have to shepherd them, and then you can collect sheep. Um, not sure if I should invest more points in collect sheep. Probably. That's like your, your one job. <laughs> your one job is to collect sheep. Uh, if I do get on that hunt, I will hope, I will hope and pray that the my NPC partner does most of the work. So I might I might just like do nothing until they're like at a good distance and then and then collect the sheep. Alright, I need to probably get rid of you. How many male bassets do I have? I don't want any more. Stop it. Come back here. Come back here. A little bit overcrowded. Retrievers, corgis. Like, I'm gonna turn you into a male. Turn you into like that. <laughs> That's how I can reduce it fairly quickly. There you go, more breeding stock. Oh, we got a random milk here. Brought to to Mammy probably took care of it for me. We got some different colored geese. Okay, I'm gonna proceed a few more. Oh, this is big. Uh, broadly for logs used to make rounded pickets. So yeah, it's the only only thing you can do with this. Turn into a log and it turns- Well, that's not really a round picket, is it? It's a cornered picket. That's a, it's a different kind of log, technically. Game, you lied. 
that's what that tree does. The mystery, the mystery is solved. It became, it became a, a tree for logs. All right. So a few more days. I feel, I feel bad. Like just keeping playing my, I, my boyfriend's back, and he's probably hungry. I was like, I'm sorry, I'm recording. Oh, these marmots are growing up. Um, uh, did you just support your baby? Yeah. All right, duck. I never got the last color tier, but that's fine. Uh, I, I, I got all the colors on a different file, <laughs> so I could just show it off there. <laughs> so we're not overwhelmed with massive amounts of animals. I need this. I need this meat. Alright, no more ducks. Rabbits, you're next on the list. Make babies. Save and proceed. I'm hoping I don't get a wild boar hunt. <laughs> I'm, I'm more interested in getting a more powerful Shiva than just registering it and dumping a bunch of points into it. It takes forever to get your points back. Mm, okay, so you're still nursing. Yeah, you're nursing. Oh, I got more search skill. Uh, you're still nursing. Let's proceed another day. Okay, you are older. What are we doing on the milkies? Oh, the goat stopped milking, so... That was kind of short. And then, yeah, we'll need to- we'll need to breed it again if we want more milk. I probably won't keep the goats for very long. Um, just because we, we kind of already traded everything we- we can get. For the cheese and like the goat milk, we've already really accomplished like that chain. Like I, I get, I get, I can trade the cheese for shebas and boars, and we already have those. I'll, I'll keep them a little longer until the cheese is uh, ripe, but then I think after that, it'll be time to get rid of them. And one more baby. What do I want to do with this goose egg? The egg is... I'm probably gonna end up tossing this. Okay. Do... Alright, it's just like in think mode. You're pregnant. You have a high chance of giving birth to a basset of the same color, but if you don't, I will just be very disappointed. <laughs> like, I don't, know, I don't know what else to say. Because my eyeballs aren't on you, my eyeballs are on... are on the Sheba. Uh, okay, got more shepherd skill. Oops. Oops. Not sure when you're gonna mature. Looks like Sophia came to invite you hunting. I'll hunt with you this time. The white rabbit. Oh god, why do you look like <laughs> freaking Bunny Python white rabbit? Uh, what's your deal? It seems to be a runaway pet rabbit. It shook off the dog sent by running into a herd of yak cows. Are you gonna summon a yak on me? Uh, sorry. That was probably very loud. A uh, white rabbit. Uh, so this unique skill. On the first turn, white rabbit performs yak herd, which summons one yak ball. So maybe I should break my corgi for that. It's like the only reason why I need to bring that corgi, and all I need to do is collect, collect it. Okay, I I'll I'll bite. 
And unfortunately, Shale does not have a collect skill. I think you can kill the Yak Bull, but it has a ridiculous amount of health. Alright. Uh, Ankle Biter? I forgot to teach Child Eater. What cattle skill? Ankle Biter, you're, you're on the block here. I want to bring Shale because Shale's attack is high. But I'm worried. I mean, I guess Marshmallow does have Collect Small. I'm just afraid if, if Marshmallow gets scared, then I'm pretty much out of a collection skill. Well, I guess... Yeah? I don't think- I don't think the rabbit... What if the rabbit goes in a hole? <laughs> oh wait, I have Chase out. Yeah, Shale should be fine in Marshmallow. Alright. YOLO. Do it. Alright, the hunt is on. Alright, we gotta collect points. It won't be possible to win without dealing with the yak cows. A corgi would be able to drive them off. Use Collect Small in the Fallen game to earn points. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think I can do this preemptively. Will not work on this animal. Yeah, it won't let me do a preemptive one. Like, the yak has to be on the field. So you're just gonna do nothing on this turn. <laughs> and I guess I'll just this attack. I'm afraid that my NPC partner is gonna kill it and take the credit. But I think about it, as long as I collect it, I should be fine. <laughs> White rabbit performs <laughs> before the yak yeah, herd. Uh, get it, Marshmallow! Get it, Shale! Lost. Now we're gonna they're gonna try to kill the yak bull. Uh, so yeah, I just cattle drive that. That has a lot of health. Uh, I can do nothing. No action. You collect small and we're gonna pray. Take that, ankle biter! Double got angry. This- No, you stole it! You stole it from us! Well, hopefully that's repeatable. I'm gonna collect that cow and I can do nothing else. Alright, that was a lot of points. <laughs> Uh, did I get the white ra I did not get the white rabbit statue. You bastard! <laughs> oh, that was successful, kind of. That must be the rabbit that ran away. Or maybe it's offspring. You used to live in a hole near the ranch. I have to give it props for using that herd of yak cows like that. Oh yeah, so I'll give you props too. Let's hunt together again sometime. Alright, let me see. If I can repeat it, then... Good. If not, then I'll have to reload. There- I think there's some hunts that are not repeatable, which is why I have to be careful. Uh, yeah, that's not a repeatable hunt. Mm. Which means I could permanently miss out on the scout skill, which is something I'd probably never use. Yeah, I don't see the white rabbit hunt. Oh no! Okay, I guess I'll reload. Uh, okay, so next time I won't attack the white rabbit until I'm ready to collect it. Oh wow. Well, maybe that'll work out because you became... You became a default facet hound. How is that? <laughs> that's that's a very low chance. Why I'm a little flustered. It's, it's a very low chance. Looks like Claire came to invite you hunting. Oh, it's a different farmer sheep got out. You can get a reward if you manage to catch him. I guess I'll go. <laughs> Let's try that one out. I got fly and then nothing else. Nothing else can help me on this. I don't have anything else that knows. Drive out! I mean, I guess we have the cheer squad. Who wants to be on the cheer squad? Probably something that I don't care about getting hurt. Um... Yeah, I guess I don't want you to get hurt. Female Bassett. Go. I don't know. <laughs> All right, the hunt is on. All right, escape sheep can be led back with shepherd from afar. Watch your rival closely. Use collect sheep when far away. Be careful not to defeat them. All right, so I guess I'll just help about by driving them off. Um, but I will not shepherd them. I will wait for my my NPC partner to do that. Bleh. 
Oh god, I gotta watch all of you bleat. <laughs> oh, tagged by one! Alright, fly, drive it off. Mm, so yeah, I'm gonna just preemptively- I'm supposed to shepherd, but I know the NPC is probably gonna want to shepherd on its own, so I'm gonna hope they do it for me. <laughs> I can collect it. Uh, I gotta listen to all you bleat. Bleh. Oh, the bleating sheep. Alright, Fokashia shepherded it. You brought it back and it entered a hole. That doesn't sound like what a sheep would do. And I can just collect it. Mine. Yoink. Alright, I'll help you drive off another one. This is so slow. <laughs> oh, you retreated on your own. They're all retreating. They're like, I ran out of alert skill. I can't yell anymore. Is, is it gonna stop? Because I technically have all of them fled. <laughs> all right. Uh, but for that, we get some sheep hair. Before we even get any sheep, we can get some sheep hair. From this side, I believe it's repeatable. So that, this is that blessing. <laughs> Oh, hello there. Wait a moment, dear. I was just about finished with this. Dipping it in water and flattening it like this turns into a fine piece of cloth. Thin it out, roll it up, and flatten it. If there are short hairs mixed in, clumps tend to form. Any yarn that doesn't come out right can always be used for felt or bedding. This work is pretty tiring, you know. Thank you for waiting. To make yarn, first you have to remove the hair debris. Otherwise, it'll feel prickly when made into a sweater. After removing the debris, I run a card over it like this, then I use a spinning wheel to twist it into yarn. All these all these yarn making tips for those guys, for those people who spin yarn. <laughs> for spin yarn, that's, I mean it's kind of a fun hobby, <laughs> like you get making, spinning your own yarn and knitting. Not everyone has those skills anymore. Then you can twist it into some yarn. You need a lot of good quality yarn to make clothes. I guess that's a bit it for now. I'll continue once the yarn is ready. I think knitting should be a job for men. You can knit with just some yarn, as long as you have the skill. I think it's the perfect activity to do while watching the sheep. And of course, if you can knit, you'll be very popular with the girls here. <laughs> Hear that, men? You can, you can fascinate a woman by knitting a sweater. I've heard that skilled, a skilled knitter can knit 200 stitches in a minute. But you don't have to be that fast. Come to think of it, my mother used to knit like this all winter long. Sorry for rambling, my dear. I should get back to work. Yeah, like, as, I mean, knitting is a thing to do, like, especially back in the day when they, when life was a little quieter, didn't have that many distractions. It's a nice little, little activity to do. And especially if you're, if you were snowed in the winter as well, um, it's a good use of your time to just make some clothes. Alright, I, I successfully completed. Yay. Runaway sheep gave up. Gave up. Okay, they gave up. You learned the alert types. Alert type 1 skill. That thing that they were bleeding at me for. <laughs> Sheep on the farms here often run away, and every time that happens, villagers seem to make even more wool and yarn. Isn't that funny? Alright, if you make it into yarn, you get different things. It doesn't go bad like meat. Uh, so unlike the rabbit hair, I think you actually have to... Yeah, you have to... You have to hit it. <laughs> hit it. Flatten it. I see you managed to make yarn. I really like to see you do more because this is where the fun really begins. You can weave bundles of good fabric with this method. We're trying to create a handmade luxury goods that you can't easily find in the city. The wool and yarn comes from our sheep, so we weave it with the proper care and attention. Wool clo clothing really easily repels a little bit of rain. I think, and like, wool has like a little bit of lanolin on it, right? Like a little oil <laughs> from, from like the sheep. So it is a little bit repellent. Oh, after washing the wool and woven cloth, you should beat it into a blend. Bl beat it to blend the seams. That's why the stitches have to be a little bit loose. I hope you find the time to learn more. If you make this into woolen yarn, you can trade it for yaks, donkeys, tomatoes, or potatoes at the market. Yeah, this opens up a lot of other animals. Uh, I just. <laughs> Probably don't want to trade for any of those yet until I can like reduce what other animals I have. Uh, I think you're gonna repeat that sheep hunt. 
Yeah, the runaway sheep is something that we can repeat, luckily. Uh, is this... What do you... You know nothing. You know nothing. Let me get rid of you. I'm tired of the female basset. But yeah, <laughs> I will probably just save that for later. Let me see what I can trade with one woolen yarn. I'm not sure if I can get like silkworms for this. Silkworms I can probably just use right away. Uh, tomato seeds, seed potatoes, young llama, young yak cow, wool crate. Two of them gets a young donkey. You might be good to start early on. Uh, you need tomatoes to feed the llamas and they make hair, while seed potatoes you feed the yak cows and they grow out their hair. Yak cows you can also breed to produce milk. Uh, but they take a lot of... hay. <laughs> a lot of hay. <laughs> Guess I can trade it for some tomato seeds, why not? I can always get more wool, so... And I'll just plop it on the ground, it'll... It'll probably sprout in dandelion. It'll just sprout in dandelion. Okay. Oh, that became a male. I do want to end off soon, because I do have to make dinner. Uh, but I think I will go a few more days. I want to see if that Shiva becomes a female before I like I Because <laughs> I'm gonna like go to sleep after this go to work and I'll just forget what I'm doing As the mind does the mind rots Old and moldy memories All right, Taking a look at you Looks like Sophia <laughs> think things might get a little dangerous, but you'll come with me, right? Uh, the mountain witch? That's different <laughs> than the white rabbit. Uh, mountain witch. I have to collect it to get gas attack. Ghost of the mountain. They say this weasel can defeat rabbits just by glaring at them from the treetops. I don't have the skill to... Mm -hmm. I'll just go deal with you. Why are you offering? I need. I think I need a pointer. I can lunge. I don't have a lunging pointer. I can get rid of the other one, the guardian weasel. That's just, that just goes in a hole. But yeah, I have nothing that can counter the climb tree skill. I think. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't have a counter for that. So sorry, you come back later. <laughs> kind of weird that they gave me that hunt before having the appropriate dog for it. <laughs> All right, save again. Of chickadees. That poor hen is surrounded by, by a brood. All right, burrow rabbit came to wreck your farm, and they ran away. Uh, but more importantly, this is a female, so good. I just have to have you make a baby. Why are you hungry? Stop being hungry. Mm, getting rid of that wiener. Uh, the cheese is done. You could trade this for a boar. They eat dead grass, you know. <laughs> Telling me again. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, so cheese. Yes, you can indeed get them for... Get another young boar from them. But we pretty much have everything we can get these for. So, yeah, we, we just got the item, so... <laughs> we, we accomplished that. Uh, you guys need to separate. This poor little sheepdog is pregnant and needs to eat meat. Uh, that one became a male. That's okay. I'm gonna turn you into meat. Yes, you turn into, into poor meat and dry you out. 
Uh, let's just hope that works. I'll save this cheese. I can trade it for a ferret when I'm ready for ferrets. I'm just gonna let that egg stay there. <laughs> Alright, let's register this wiener dog. I just want to get rid of it. Sorry, little wiener. <laughs> You're gonna retire, in quotation marks. You're gonna go to the farm in the sky. Okay. Like we're ready to end. It's time for me to make dinner. Alright, we did a lot of different hunts. We didn't... We, <laughs> we gotta remember what my strategy is gonna be on the white rabbit hunt. The second go around, but... Yeah, I... I I definitely want to do that the right way, because I can't repeat it. Alright, so let's save. Okie doke. Hope you guys are having a fun and relaxing time, and I'll see you in the next episode. Oh, bye bye.